Um, well, good question. Actually, you know, I think I really have a very tough job, right? It's a very challenging job. Um, you know, when I first joined this company, I thought it's a technology company. And now I know it's about people. It's about safety. You know, last year there were two terrible incidents happened on our platform. Two young girls got killed. It was devastating, right? And for all of the senior executive, i.e. the 25-year-olds, right? You know, we sat together and think to ourselves, what's the next step, right? This is much more challenging than when Uber came in or when, you know, other competition came in. Was the, drive, was the death because of the driver did something wrong? Yes, the driver, yeah, the driver was a criminal. So how do you screen those kind of people in the future? Right, after, so after that, now we launched more than 40 product features about safety, facial recognition, okay right, uh, route sharing, so itinerary sharing, so there are 40 of them. But the challenge part is not about how committed we can be for safety. It's, there are a lot of dilemmas that I can't right. ask our data scientists for an answer to. It's a social problem. For example, you know, one dilemma we face is, do we allow drivers to reject drunk passengers? Because there are a lot of internal conflict from drunk passengers tend to assault drivers. Right? So drivers complain to us, hundreds of them complain to us daily, saying, can we reject this drunk passenger? Do we allow it or not? So what do you do? We put up a nationwide consultation forum and we ask people's feedback. 80% of them thinks we should. It's a surprise to us because our original concern was if we let that happen, then what if something bad happened to the drunk passenger? Right. So what we do not encourage is drunk passengers to ride by themselves. They need to be accompanied by a sober friend. How do you make sure your drivers are not drunk? <clears throat> oh, that's very easy. That's very easy. Do you easy. have a breathalyzer or what do you do? How do you make sure? Yeah, Certainly. we have this SDK on all the drivers' cell phones. So if they drive dangerously, speed driving, you know, hard brake, hard turn, we test it immediately. Right. And before he gets, um, you know, he, he pick up order, we will do facial recognition and their phone calls if we see anything, you know, okay. random. So in the United